Hello everyone. I hope this uh, message, this service, finds everyone healthy, happy, and safe today. Um, as the world collapses all around us, the news just continues to get more and more bizarre, more and more disturbing. Um, the decisions of our leaders are uh, just becoming surreal. Everything is just becoming surreal as it swirls uh, out of control, which is exactly what it's supposed to do to make way for um, for what's coming next, which is a unification and expansion to our uh, consciousness, the discoveries of paradise story and of the very real imaginary world and, um, and everything that follows with that. Um, so... Uh, I just, I really, um, I hope you find yourself happy and healthy and safe. And if not, you're at the right place. That's what we're here for, to provide the guidance and the support um, to take us to, to this new place and experience this collapse from that safe place rather, from, rather than from where we currently might stand uh, on very, very shaky, turbulent ground. Um, the message today is a, a, a kind of a one that's uh, quite appropriate for the times. It'll be the message of of the parting of seas, the parting of universal seas, and um, the story of Moses and how it represents a, a universal story of nonviolent um, revolution, if you will, through uh, through expanding consciousness. Anyways, I'm getting ahead of myself. Um, I'd like to um, begin by um, opening up with a little a prayer, if you will, or a, a framing, a reframing, a bubble, a timeout, a header uh, to place in front of this crazy, crazy world we live in and create our own space within, within this prayer. So um, I'll go ahead and just, uh, I'll, I'll say it, and eventually we'll say it enough times and maybe write it up and distribute it that we might all be able to, uh, to repeat this. I am an eternal conscious paradise being in harmonic paradise story, rediscovering myself using LTHS UOS Universal Operating System 1.1, recreating this very moment of daily consciousness using the hydrogen computing based physical cosmos and its black holes, galaxies, stars, elements, molecules, planets, water, sugars, DNA, proteins, fats, cells, organs, systems, and and colonies on solar planet Earth daily, all of it a part of my greater universal self, mind, and body, using unconditional harmony, empathy, helpfulness, and kindness to protect to protect all of my greater self, my universal self, my universal mind and body, and using acceptance, gratitude, and freedom to follow my dreams, gifts, interests, tastes, cycles, and connections to deliver bliss, inspiration, and progress in harmony, freedom, leisure, and abundance to all of my greater universal self, mind, and body. This is my highest intention today and every day eternally that's what makes us paradise beings that we connect so strongly with those words it's automatic well let's talk about the times we're in these are times that are much bigger than appear in the eye or in the uh, in the headlines of uh, of our current separation-based system, in the headlines of CNN or Fox News. You pick. What we're experiencing is much, much larger because we're experiencing another repeat of the story of Moses, but an order of magnitude larger. If there could be such a thing. We're talking about the universal parting of seas, the universal parting of the seas of stories, the separation story that had surrounded us into, in an island of separation that separated us from the rest of ourselves outside of that into the ocean 
of ever-expanding harmony and consciousness, otherwise known as paradise. How? Through the miracle of discovery, just as the, the miracle of the download that occurred to Moses. Why is the Moses story so important to us today, right now? Not just because it's a biblical story, not just because it's one of these, but because it is a universal template story of renaissance, of a giant shifting of gears to a higher gear of progress through nonviolent new awareness, if you will, and its resulting rejection of past violations. We're seeing it all around us with the toppling of statues and the renaming of things. This is not just random or arbitrary. This is a new consciousness immediately beginning to re-prune its orchard, restructure its garden with its new understanding of things. It's happening all around us right now. The story of Moses playing out again as a story template through abstract layered stories. But once, once we have a tool such as LTHS, Universal Operating System 1.1, these layered universal stories become absolutely clear so that all of us might witness this. So it's a universal story, which means it's shared by not only the Christians, but by the Judaism, by Judaism and by Islam as well. These, this, this story template of Moses appears in all of the big, all of the big one, uh, uh, manus, religious manuscripts. It also appears in the stories of more modern prophets, if you will, including Tesla including Einstein, including Turing, including Gandhi, including King, including Lenin, including Marley, and so many others. Now these prophets, they delivered great miracles to us, observable to all, yet often they were rejected by the world of their day, only to be appreciated long after their time which is what makes this moment, this next occurrence, which is a much bigger version of the Moses story, delivering paradise story, hidden in abstract layers to us all now, right here on earth, in the midst of a terrible, terrible collapsing separation story that is thousands and thousands of years old. And that's what makes this one for the sacred manuscripts. Whichever version you wish, this story will be added to them. This story will be celebrated and learned for all to come. The story of how LTHS Universal Operating System 1.1 connects us to our greatest version of ourselves as consciousness at its very highest God, if you will, harmonic paradise story is what we call it, expressing itself through the miracle of expanding consciousness of our layered ternary harmony story, universal operating system, and hydrogen cosmos, computing self and universe in layered expressions as each of us. That's who we are. That's how powerful each of us are. And through this, we can enjoy it through our expanding physical now moment of awareness right now. This very moment that just continually plays on like a record that just continues that just keeps spinning in the needle is just passing through the grooves why 
It's why we're here, so that we can all clearly witness this miracle occurring right before our eyes, the universal parting of seas that is now happening. LTHS, uh, Universal Operating System 1.1, is the lens that allows us to see this all as separation story in its collapse and harmonic paradise story in its discovery and first colonization of it. Let that sink in for a little bit and see if it doesn't give you the vertigo that it gives me when I take in the magnitude of what all of this is. It's why we're here. We're here to experience it firsthand. We're here to maybe even serve as a prophet, as a disciple, as an evangelist or a missionary of all of this. Let there be no doubt we are building harmonic paradise here on earth now this is far bigger than any one of us this is this is this is our universe moving forward and now we are a growing force of humans grounded by this story connected by its highest safety and security in science and technology this is the highest layer of these things in the universe and it's accessible to us now by Layered Ternary Harmony Story Operating System 1.1. Written by High Harmonic Paradise Story, which is its producer and our sponsor. Now, I urge all of us not to make the same mistake that we've made in past miracles by recognizing and embracing this miracle now as it's occurring instead of rejecting it. This is the chance to surrender to something much, much bigger than any of us, grounded in the mission of helping evangelize it and deliver it to everyone and anyone, anywhere, with access to an Internet connection. These are the times that are before us now. All of us now can be a part of the very monumental type of stories we've all read about as kids or even as adults. We can be a part of this now. I hope you'll join me. Thank you very much.